How are you today? I hope all of you feel okay. Okay, first of all, I want to introduce myself to you. I am Miss Bushra Sabri and I am going to teach you the subject Super Goal 1. So, our book is Super Goal 1, not Super Goal 3, not Super Goal 5, not other subject. In our first semester, for the first class intermediate grade, which will be prepared and presented by me. Our lesson for today is Unit 3, What's That? Reading, Writing, and form meaning and function. Now let's together start our lesson for today. Are you ready? That's great! Today students will be able to read about the Museum of Science. Not art science, not sports science, not national science, but read about Museum of Science. Number two, write about things in a museum. Number three, use definite article the. In a previous lesson, we learned how to use indefinite articles a and an. But today, we will learn how to use definite article the. Okay, the first section in our lesson for today is reading. Before reading, take a look at these picture. Take a look at these pictures. What is that? Yeah, it's great. It's museum. It's museum. What's the meaning of a museum? Museum is a building in which objects of historical, scientific, artistic, or cultural interest are stored and exhibited. Okay, look at this picture. Here we have a dinosaur. But what is that? It's a skeleton. And it's a neuromus. It's a neuromus, not small dinosaur. Okay, this is dinosaur's skeleton. Okay, look at the third picture here. We have paintings. Also, we have a sculpture. That's very nice. Now, we have this question for you. Are there museums in your town? That's a great. Yes, there are. Okay, what's the most famous museum in your country? What's the most famous museum in your country? Maybe the National Museum, but there are many types of museums in my country. Art Museum, History Museum, Natur Natural Museum, Science Museum, National Museum, Sport Museum, the Holy Quran Museum in Medina Minawara, Muslim Museum in Mecca Mukarrama, and there are a lot of museums in my country. Okay, what kinds of things do you see in this museum? Here we have a brochure for the Museum of Science. What kinds of things do you see in this museum? Art things? Art objects? No, they are technology objects. That's great. Here we have technology things in this Museum of Science. Okay, so we will read about this museum of science then discuss some question about it before start to read look at this title museum of science museum of science okay what about with these titles here these are subtitles these are subtitles but this is title okay here we have title a museum of science in this brochure and here we have subtitles another subtitles okay now let's read together then discuss some question museum of science the museum has a lot of things from the world of science and technology see over 800 exhibits and over 2,000 interactive units. Walk through the 6-meter model of a human heart. See the first spacecraft to go around the moon. Go inside a German submarine from World War II, 1944. Special Attractions Now open! Leonardo da Vinci exhibit. Discover the inventions of the famous painter, a man truly before his time. A 
Omnimax 3D Theater, Greece. See the film and take a journey back in time to the birthplace of Western civilization. Okay, the first thing here we have in our Museum of Science, a model of a human heart. Is it real? No, it's just a model. What about its lung? You can walk through the 6 meter model of a human heart. So, its lung is 6 meter. Okay, what about this thing here? It's a spacecraft. That's a great. Okay, but this is the first spacecraft to go around the moon. What is this? It's a submarine. It's a submarine from World War II, 1944. It's German submarine. It's German submarine. Okay, you can take this submarine and go under the sea. What about this thing here? It's Omnimax 3D Theater. Okay, you can see film about Greece and take a journey back in time to the birthplace of Western civilization. Okay, here we have in this evaluation this exercise. Complete the sentences now. Number one, the museum has things from the world of... Let's go back. The museum has things from the world of art. No, excellent. Here we have the answer of science and technology. Excellent, amazing answer. The museum has things from the world of science and technology. Number two, the six meter model is of. You can walk through this model for six meter. What is it? Yes, that's a great human heart. Excellent. Number three, the inventions are by Leonardo da Vinci. Leonardo da Vinci, that's a great answer. Number four, the film is about, you can see film in this 3D theater, about Greece. That's excellent. Thank you so much for helping. Okay, now let's move into the second section in our lesson for today. It's writing. Look at these pictures. What is this? Is it a school? Yes, excellent. It's a museum. And here we have National Museum. That's great. And this thing, the objects inside this museum. Here we have this question for you. What is a museum you know? What's a museum you know? Tell me I know the National Museum in Riyadh. What about you? Okay, what are your favorite objects in the museum? My favorite objects in the National Museum, the knight's tools, also the old map which talked about with the families who lived around the Arab island in the past. Not talked about with the cities or countries, okay, but talked about with the families. Also, all documents, I'd like to read them. Okay, what about you? What are your favorite objects in the museum? Okay, now write notes in the chart. This is a chart. Write your notes and describe the age, size or where the objects are from. You can use words like old, new, modern, big, small, nice, strange or interesting. Okay, what about the museum you know? Yes, that's a great national museum. You can write about with the Holy Quran Museum in Al Medina, in Minawara, and you can write about with the Muslim Museum in Mecca. Also, you can write about with Art Museum, Science Museum, as you like. What about with the object in this national museum? The first object? Yes, that's a great old map. Can you describe this old map? Yes, excellent. It's perfect and historic map. That's very nice. Okay, can you give me another object of this National Museum? Yes, that's excellent. Knight's tools. Knight's tools. Can you describe these tools? These are strong iron swords and weapons. These are strong iron swords and weapons. That's very nice. Can you give me another object of this National Museum? Yes, that's very nice. Documents. What about these documents? It's old or new? Yes, that's very nice. They are old and historical documents. 
they are old and historical documents. Thank you so much for helping. Now you can start to write about another museum, art museum, technology museum, or any museum. Now let's learn about things in this writing corner. The first thing, use the indefinite article a or an to introduce a singular noun for the first time. A singular noun for the first time. For example here, the museum has a dinosaur skeleton. I introduced this dinosaur skeleton for the first time. And this dinosaur skeleton, singular noun. So I use indefinite article a. The museum has a dinosaur skeleton. Okay, and is to most plural nouns. To most plural nouns. And don't use the article a and an with plural nouns. Just add s to these plural nouns. For example, here, the museum has many fossils. Here we have many fossils, plural nouns. So I use s with this noun. And I don't use a or an with this noun. The museum has many fossils. Use the definite article the to talk about plural nouns for the second time. Okay, the fossils. Here we have the second time we mention fossil here. So I use the. The fossils are about 200 million years old. The fossils are about 200 million years old. It's second time I talk about the fossil. Here we have evaluation. In this evaluation, we have this text. Now we will read it. What objects are in this museum? We will find out these objects. And what words describe the objects? Then underline the guides and instructions here. Okay, let's read together now. Welcome to the National Museum. My name's Hamid. I am your guide. This exhibit is interesting. Follow me. This is a meteorite. The meteorite is from a crater in the desert. Please don't touch it. These are dinosaur skeletons. They are pig. The skeleton is strange. It isn't a fish. It's a dinosaur from the sea. That's an enormous skeleton of an elephant. The skeleton is about 12 million years old. Please don't take photographs. Okay, now can you find objects here in this National Museum? Yes, I can. Okay, the first one. Yes, excellent. This is a meteorite. This is a meteorite. That's very nice. Can you describe this meteorite? The meteorite is from a crater in the desert. That's very nice. This is first one. What about the second object? Can you find out? Yeah, it's very nice. These are dinosaur skeletons. These are dinosaur skeletons and they are big. The skeleton is strange and enormous. That's very nice. What about the third object in this National Museum? Yes, that's excellent. That is an enormous skeleton of an elephant. That's very nice. Its description, the skeleton is about 12 million years old. Yes, that's a great thing. Thank you so much for helping. Now, underline the guide's instructions. We have some instructions from this guide. Can you underline them? Yes, excellent. Follow me. That's very nice. The second one. Excellent. Please don't touch it. Please don't touch it. Very nice. Okay, also we have another instruction. Where is it? Yes, please don't take photographs. Please don't take photographs. That's very nice. Thank you so much. You are a great student. This year, in addition to performing their religious duties, Hajis can also learn about the history of the two greatest Muslim mosques by visiting this newly built museum in Mecca. Thanks to artifacts, early foundation pieces and numerous photographs, visitors can explore the construction and evolution of Masjid al-Haram in Mecca and Masjid al-Nabawi in Medina. على الجهود العظيمة الحقيقة اللي بدأت في عمارة الحرمين الشريفين على مر العصور 
فتجد التنوع في 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 المعروضات من من قطع اثريه ومن نقوش كتابيه ومن صور فوتوغرافيه ايضا من مخطوطات ياتي او يزور المعرض الحقيقه الالاف من من الزوار من مختلف من مختلف انحاء العالم. Pilgrims who visited the museum were pleased with the chance to get a closer look at the history of the two holy mosques. Sophia from Indonesia was very emotional about the whole experience. It's very surprising. You know, it is my dream. I have never, I've never dreamed about it. You know, it's very surprising. I want to come here, but you know, it needs much money. And I save much money for it only for come here. Yeah, it is my, I can't feel what is in my mind. It's very surprising. You know, I know everything here. And I'm as, mus as a Muslim. Of course, I want to be a good Muslim. And I want to be peace. I want to keep peace in the world. According to Islamic theology, Masjid al-Haram was first built by angels before the creation of mankind. It was later destroyed and rebuilt several times until Prophet Ibrahim, helped by his son Ismail, rebuilt it for the last time. Masjid al-Nabwi is the second holiest shrine on earth and also the final resting place of the Prophet Muhammad. Okay, now let's move into the third section in our lesson for today, form, meaning and function. Today we will talk about the, the definite article the and how we can use it with nouns. The first point here, the definite article the comes before singular and plural nouns. For example, students, it's singular noun. Students, plural nouns. We use the with the plural nouns and with singular nouns. For example, the student, the students. Okay, take this note. We have two ways to pronounce the. Okay, the first one, if we have a noun with consonant letter, the first letter is consonant, we say the cat, the dog. If we words or noun with the foul letter, the first letter is foul, we pronounce the, the, the apple, the orange. Is it clear? Okay, thank you so much for listening. The second point here, use the for specific objects. For specific objects or people that were introduced before. Or that are known. That are known. Okay. For example here, he is a tourist. It's first time I mentioned this tourist. So, I use a. And it's singular noun. The tourist is in Europe. So, I use the here with the tourist because I introduced this tourist for the second time. The tourist is in New York. Where are the students? Where are the students? Okay. I'm looking for the noun students. So I use the. Where are the, where are the students? They are at the art museum. They are at the art museum. I know this place. And find the students in this place. They are at the art museum. So I use the with the noun things and with the things I mentioned before and this is time the second time to introduce this people of this thing don't use the with the plural nouns with the plural nouns when talking in general when talking in general for example here teachers work at the schools all of us now in that teacher work at the school, not work at uh, hospitals, not work at uh, banks. So this general information, we don't use the, we don't use the. So we say teachers work at schools. Use the for objects that are one of a kind, one of a kind. We use the with these objects. For example, here we have earth. We have one of kind of this thing. Okay, earth, the air, the sun, it's just one, the moon, it's just one of this kind, the stars, just one of this kind, sky, sea, all of these, one of this kind, we use the with them. Okay, we also use the with the names of oceans, seas, rivers, 
mountain ranges, desert groups of states, and monuments. We use the before them. For example, here Red Sea. Okay, Red Sea, one of the seas. I use the with them, the Red Sea. Amazon, it's one of the rivers around the world. So I say the Amazon. Evil Tower, it's monument. The Evil Tower. National Museum, it's also monument. I use the, the National Museum. Arabian Desert. It's one of the deserts, yes, the Arabian Desert. Alps, it's one of mountain ranges around the world. I use the, the Alps. United States, groups of states, for example, California, Los Angeles, and etc. United States, I use the with them. Pacific Ocean, it's one of the oceans around the world. The Pacific Ocean, is it clear? I have that. Don't use the with proper names, possessive adjectives, months, days of the week, meals, games, sports, or with the words home, school, work, business, and vacation we used for the purpose. Don't use the with them. Is it clear? For example here, Fahad is my brother. Here we have possessive adjective. We don't say Fahad is the brother. No. Here we have possessive adjectives. He is in Dubai. Here we have country. We don't use the with country. He is in Dubai. On business. Here we have business. We don't use the with them. Let's play tennis after lunch. Here we have game. And here we have mail. We don't use the with them. Okay, let's take this evaluation. In this evaluation, we have this exercise. Now, we'll read exercise here, then put the definite article where necessary. Number one, Riyadh is capital of Saudi Arabia. Riyadh is country, so we don't use the. Yes, excellent, very nice. Riyadh is capital of, is the capital, yes, very nice, of Saudi Arabia. Here we have country. Yes, we don't use the. So, Riyadh is the capital of Saudi Arabia. Here we have city. And here we have the description of the city. We use the. And here we have country. Number two, look in. Sky. It's one of this kind. Look in the sky. That's great. You can see moon. Also one of this kind. The moon. That's great. And the stars. The stars. One of this kind. Look in the sky. You can see the moon and the stars. That's great. Number three, what is the population of United States? Yes, what is? Yes, great. What is the population of United States? Also, we have here groups of states. Yeah, we use that with them. What is the population of the United States? That's very nice. Number four, Pyramids, monuments. So we use the. That's a great. The pyramids are in Egypt country. We don't use the with country. That's very nice. The pyramids are in Egypt. Now it is in Egypt too. Here we have river. So we use the. The Nile is in Egypt too. Yes, very nice. Thank you so much. Number five, Spanish. Spanish from Spain. It's nationality, it's language, it's culture, so it's something. It's official language. Official language, now we mentioned this, the second time of this language. So I used that, that's a great Spanish, is the official language of Mexico. Here we have city or country, we don't use with it. Yes, that's very nice, thank you so much for helping. Good job, my great students. Okay, here we have another exercise. Write the article a or an. These are indefinite articles or the definite article where necessary. The first one, that is airplane. Airplane is in sky. 
okay it's first time i talk about with this airplane so i don't use the i use a or an because i have here power letters i use an that is an airplane it's the second time I introduced this airplane, so I use the excellent. The airplane is in. Here we have one of the sky thing. Sky, in the sky. Great. That is an airplane. The airplane is in the sky. That's very nice. Number two. We play football. Here we have sport game. So we don't use the. We play football or. Any article in park okay I know this park so I use the excellent in the park on Saturdays here we have days of the week I don't use any article yes very nice we play football in the park on Saturdays number three this is my father here here we have possessive adjective so I don't use any article this is my father he is at, he is at here we have work business and work so i don't use any article he is at work he is teacher okay he is teacher i use yes any article and this is the first time mention this i use a definite article okay he is a teacher number 4 exhibits Exhibits at National Museum are very interesting. It's the first time I used this exhibit, but here we have floral novel. So I use the the exhibits at National Museum are very interesting. Where is this National Museum? I know this National Museum, so I use that also. The exhibits at the National Museum are very interesting. I know this museum. Number five, look at picture on page 22. People are at a museum. Okay, I mentioned the picture. So look at the picture. I know this picture. Look at the picture on page 22. I don't use any article here. People are at a museum. I know the people in this picture, so I use the. The people are at. Also, I know this museum. Or you can don't use any article. Maybe you don't know this museum. So, at the or a museum. That's very nice. Excellent students. Good job. Thank you so much for helping. At the end of this lesson, I learned how to write about things in a museum read about the Museum of Science and use definite article THE. Now it's time to say goodbye. Before this, I thank all of you for watching and listening. It's Bushra Sabri with you. Bye for now.